In this video, I'm going to show you how to increase your page load speed really easily using gzip compression. Just a little piece of code you put into your HT access file makes your pages load a whole lot faster. Super low hanging fruit. I suggest you do it right away. And I'm going to show you how to do it in this video. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. It's Bjorn from WP Learning Lab, where we help you get better at WordPress so you can earn more for yourself, for your clients, and for your business. If you haven't done so yet, hit subscribe and hit the bell notification icon so you're notified when I publish more tutorials for you. And just for curiosity's sake, what's your page load speed? Is it fast? Is it slow? What's the exact number? Leave it down in the comments below. Just be interesting to see what all our page load speeds are. Now let's head over to the screen capture and learn how to gzip our website. I'll see you there. Here I'm at an HTTP compression test website. You can go to this URL to get to this one or you can Google one. There's a lot of them out there. Enter your URL into the bar here in the input field and click on test. And we're gonna see whether compression is a viable option for us. And here it shows that this website is not compressed. Our page size is 16.4 kilobytes. It could be reduced to 4.7, which is a reduction of 71.2%, which is kind of a big deal. Uh, consider that your website is being loaded every time a visitor comes and every page will benefit from compression and potentially every page will be reduced by 71.2%. That's huge on server load, page load time, user experience, just everything gets better the faster your page is. So this site is a candidate. Hopefully yours is as well. If it is, I'm gonna show you how to add gzip compression to your site right now. I'm gonna head over to my cPanel, then click on File Manager. Mine went right to the files. Yours may have shown a pop-up first. In that pop-up, if there is a Show Hidden Files checkbox, make sure it's checked. In my server, there's a settings button in the top right here, and that's where my show hidden files checkbox is. We're gonna need that to be checked to be able to see the HT access file. So we're gonna navigate to the root of the website. Here's our HT access file. This is where the code is gonna to go to gzip. If you don't have this file, if you've, you've confirmed that your show hidden files is activated, but you don't have this file, you click on plus file up here to create it, and just type in .ht access. Then click on create new file, just gonna be blank. But if you have a WordPress site set up, more than likely you have an HT access file already because WordPress adds some code to it. So if we click on editor, click on the file first, then click on editor. This is the WordPress code. So every WordPress site has at least this. So you should have an HT access file. This first one is from a special plugin that we use. And down below at the very bottom, I'm just gonna paste in this code, which I'm gonna to link to in a blog post in the description down below because some special characters YouTube won't allow in the description. So just to be safe, I'm gonna put this into a blog post and that's all we have to do. Just paste that in there, then click on save changes, head back over to our compression test, click on test again, and now it's showing this site is being compressed and the savings that it said were possible appear to have been applied. And that is how we do gzip compression. There's another type of compression that's mentioned right here, mod deflate compression which I have in another video. Which one you choose is up to you. They both should work the same. So try one of them. If it doesn't work, try the other. If neither works, leave a comment down below. We'll find a different way to compress your site because there are server-side languages that allow you to do compression. Um, anyway, neither here nor there. That's gzip. Now hopefully your site is compressed. So that's how we gzip our site. Super easy, super low-hanging fruit. You see almost instant page load speed increase, which is awesome. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below the video. If you haven't done so yet, hit subscribe, then hit the bell notification icon so you don't miss anything. And next up is clicking one of these videos that appear on the right hand side over here so you can learn even more about WordPress. And until next time, keep crushing it and I will see you in the next video.